Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, everybody. Good to see you all. Um, let me get my mouse here so I can read the chat. Uh, welcome, Midnight, Anton, Florian, Ognum, Maf Maleficienta. Welcome, MSG, Josh, Clive, uh, Martin, Ben, uh, James, Grill Bears, and Domorn. Welcome. Uh, welcome to the stream. Good to see you. I hope you guys are doing all right. We're going to be jumping back into uh, junkyard journeys today scrapyard engineering in other words but i didn't i didn't want to use the same title <laughs> so we're going to junkyard journeys um i hope you guys are doing all right having a good weekend uh, welcome for the old gamer good to see you as well i hope you're doing all right let's get some music going Since I caught your last stream and your help, I have mastered this scenario. <laughs> uh, nice. Let's uh, continue. Let's get this thing loaded up. Um, yeah, of course, we have to make sure that we are on the other side. So today I'm wearing my HDHD t-shirt. We're going to switch to the other side just that you know you won't be able to read it anymore. <laughs> um... Bloop, bloop. Hello, welcome on the other side. I figured out how to get uh, a other planet and got it working. Nice. I'm going to put the music a little bit quieter. Let's say about this. Let me know if it's okay compared with the sound of the game. I'll... Uh... I'm not sure if you hear anything. Maybe my game is a little bit quiet. I'm just trying to make some noise, but... How is the noise? <laughs> Um, unuseful, good to see you, welcome, old explorer, good to see you, how are you doing? How can I save my game but don't have it over right it, if I start a new one? How can I save my game but... Oh, most of the time what I do, Dom, uh, is actually just, uh, I set my whole world up, then I just, um, uh, I go into my, uh, load game. I select that world and I say save as and I make a second save so I can always start the second save and I have the template. You should be able to make a workshop or a um, you should be able to make like a scenario out of it but for the moment I'm gonna have to uh, I don't know I don't know. The game is very quiet. How is the music compared with my voice so that I can adjust that first and then I can adjust the game sound. Um. So what I did, I drove my rover back home. As you can see, we have our um, our battery with us. We've got music is okay for... Okay, so I'm going to raise the game sound a bit. I'm just trying to see how this sounds I can adjust again if necessary I uh, had to reload to get the live stream hmm weird primal wolf welcome I can make a day in the game I know um sounds noise okay uh, oh, by the way, is my bot working? Yes, it is. It should be working. Uh, I went with the large grid rover on the world you use. Hardest part is the gyros. Yes. Uh, the gyros are the worst. Especially because I don't think you can actually find large grid gyros in the world. Um, so, yeah. Somebody said that I actually exploded my... Uh, my... Somebody said I exploded my thruster that was hanging here. I believe them. Wouldn't surprise me. Um, I got one, two, three, 
four, five. So I got five thrusters, which should be enough to create a flyer. Now, the problem is, I am missing some grids. I think. Let me just double check. This is okay. This is okay. I'm missing eight grids. I don't want to grind down anything of my uh, things yet. Uh, my con containers. I want to find some more. That's t t Today's plan is to find more grids. Now, before we do that, and while it's night, we're going to build an extra section and section in the front of the rover. So I have another sections of another set of wheels and a bit more platform. Um, for my SC rover, I swapped to my 5x5. Five five. Yeah, these are 5x5s. Five five Having to log out of SC to watch an SC stream. <laughs> uh, Galarak. should get a, a little little PC to, to watch stream so you don't have to give your game up. Oh, I think I was pressing the wrong button with the other thing. Oh no, I wasn't. Okay. So, we got a large we got a large uh, solar panel which can be handy for maybe a ship in the future. As I have the wind turbines, I think the wind turbines are just better for it anyway, so. Um, by the way, Galarak, I don't know if I said hello to you, but good to see you. Welcome. Um, welcome, Ras Mavik. Uh, welcome as well. Good to see you. I hope you're doing all right. Uh, having to log out. What wheels are you using? It's okay to ask. I'm originally from Belgium, uh, Dom, but it's been a while since I lived there. Need an exploding thruster count like Jason Dead Counter. That's three so far. Um, I think it's two. Ogden. Callan, welcome. I have been watching all your content, been really enjoying it. Hey, Callan, appreciate that. Thank you. Um, yeah, I've been I've been more and more focused on space engineers. Now that I have... Oh, what? Yeah, thank you. Um, I really enjoy the game anyway, but now that I have a little bit more of a hang of it, I feel like I'm feeling more uh, confident in creating more and more content about it. Especially if you're doing scenarios that are pretty focused on, you know, engineering. How are you picking up with the torch out? I thought you had to use the zero key. The, the torch is just my light, no? The torch is just my headlights. Uh, Balsarek, welcome as well. Good to see you. Thank you for joining. Um, welding torch. Oh no, I can I can with I can do it with my welding torch, no problem. I'm just putting it's better to not have your torch in your hand. Just safer. Uh good news Plitzy says yeah he's been working on some new plot. Well it's he's reworking his tutorials, no. I got so much stuff here. We definitely have enough to build a, a flyer soon. I might have to look into more power cells. I don't know. We'll see. Um, I think I need a little uh, letterbox in the back of my... Um, I Actually, I have. <laughs> there. <laughs> Uh, grab uh, when I'm holding a block and trying to line it up to a grid and sparks happen is that damaging stuff no the the damaging stuff will uh, happen when you hit it very very hard on the floor and your thruster explodes
No, I'm not gonna be able to grab my mag plate there. Okay, so let's say um, seven, six. Did we take everything off here? It looks like it. So the only thing that we still need to bring over is the battery. That's all now. So, we got another container, which I think we got two now. So, that's a good start as well. Then, we got a few batteries. We got a whole bunch of uh, these here, which is something we're going to have to look in. Although, I, I didn't think... I don't think we found a single hydrogen thruster so far. Did we? Yo, Dread, no worries. I saw that you had uh, some issues, I mean issues, you know, things to deal with at home with uh, the family, as in, you know, health-wise. So, totally understand, man. No worries. I think we're gonna have to do some organizing. But as far as I know, we do not have a single hydrogen thruster yet. Good to hear, Agnam. Appreciate that. Um, you need to hire a cleaning lady. We, the thing is, you know what I'm thinking, Florian? It's like, okay, I can sort this all out. I can put this all on a nice little spot. But nobody is going to come and pick this up. So I'm not, I'm not going to be able to do any trading. And as soon as I can make a flyer, I'm going to make a flyer. As soon as I can go to space, I am going to space. And then I'm going to have this very nice organized setting that I'm never going to see anymore because I'm in space. Just waste of my time. <laughs> uh, any chance you have a water pumper that... <laughs> no. <laughs> um, so, we're going to... Are you fixed still? Yes. So, batteries are no longer on charge. This is no on charge. We can do this and drive forward. I'm gonna drop off my battery. Um, it's calming down. That's good to hear, uh, Dread. The RNG kind of hurts sometimes. I've got an L six large grids, large six large grid large cargos, and even grids to make five of them. Yeah. <laughs> uh. Uh, uh, if a small or longer hydro shank is ground down below hack, do you lose? Yes. You have to make sure that the. Um, I mean, you have to hack it, of course, but you have to weld it up as quickly as possible again as well. If you if you look at your tank, you will see... You see here the, the hack line. I think as soon as you grind away the computers, your tank is starting to leak. And it's that amount per second. So you grind down, you weld it up straight away again. You will always lose a little bit. But, uh, yeah... The quicker you are, the better. At least in... The quicker you are in, in grinding and welding up. That's not appropriate everywhere to be quick. You 
you should see my gaming inventory freaking goes to these sets and when i'll play um i used to be very very ocd at least in like uh organization stuff then i just saw all the pointlessness of it <laughs> Um, you should see my inventories in No Man's Sky. <laughs> I do uh, send some people crazy. Do you need a lot of cargo for better builds? Um, you need a lot of cargo for the resources you're taking. Be be because you are taking quite a lot of... I mean, I've been welding up a lot of... Uh, grinding a lot of, like, interior plates and stuff. And steel plates, although my steel plates are starting to dwindle. I got six metal grids still. Is this all I have? I need two more metal grids. Yeah, I saw that Malef uh, Maleficenta. Um, I also find it a little bit of a shame that we don't have the same enemies. Because I would have loved that. But it is what it is now. We can deal with it. So, is it safe? No, Paul is not safe. At least not in the world of Splitsy. I think we had this topic like two years ago. <laughs> I do believe a sword button should be definitely in a game, more and more. Um, it's definitely something I miss, like in No Man's Sky as well. But soon, soon, guys, we're gonna. Inst if I find, actually, don't we have a programmable block here? Wait, did I not find a single programmable block? What's this? What are you? I just smacked myself in my face with a programmable block. I would like to move my body outside, please. Thank you. I would love to be able to gr <laughs> take your body and put him in the ground and uh, bury him. <laughs> uh, so, this was a programmable block, no? Yeah. So, I could build... Uh, I could put uh, Ice Izzy in here. Uh, Matthew, did I say hello to you? I don't think so. Welcome. Tripped on a small battery. <laughs> yeah, most likely. Uh, Pes, good to see you, man. How are you? There's only one side with displays on this, it seems. Okay, so we're going to put the battery here. And then um, have the display pointing outside with some glass. 
Music is just enough to fill the sound, but the game is quiet. It is a quiet game, though, until I start welding. So... I can definitely raise it if you want to get a little bit more uh, audio. Game audio. I mean, Midnight definitely hurt my thing. So he knew I died. Alright. That should be enough. Let's get the merge blocks out. Uh, how does all the... I do not have the... Um, I don't have the... What you call it? Trash removal enabled here. As it's not on a server, I don't need to bother about that. Oh, I watched it happen. I watched it happen. Okay, let me raise the game a bit then. Put on 70 this time. I cannot withdraw computers. Come on. There we go. I think uh, Splitzy is also working with a different kind of trash removal on his servers. If I enable trash removal, all my blocks are gone, so I cannot do that. I wonder if I would magplate them all on my base, would they be trash removed? Remove trash? I don't know what the word is. Um, I just... Whee! Um... How does all those small... Uh, this and I start with... Uh, 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 this server has trash removal, but uh, made a mod that makes the scrap beacons have a 250 meter range instead. If your trash removal on your server, it will despawn at all. Yeah. So these beak. So the trash removal works with beacons. Yeah. Well, you know what? It's working for me. I don't have a problem. But if I would do a server, it would definitely be hard. To um. um Yeah, 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 yeah. It's okay. It's okay. I am learning. I'm learning definitely also the modding. So, uh, bit by bit. Bit by bit, we're gonna get somewhere. Alright, I'm gonna drive my rover back. It is getting light. So, let's see if we can get this uh, wheels on the front before it goes really, really light.
Okay, we do, we're gonna do this again. You remember the last time we were, on the, we were trying this and then somebody said we go, had to go and explore. Okay, how many blocks do we want to put in between these two? Can I have a cookie? Hey, Daivante, welcome. Good to see you, man. How are you? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. here short suspension left five by five wait and then right I think I'd actually put the wheels too close. <laughs> Did I miss my cookie? I think you missed your cookie. It came in your cookie. Uh, I should put the wheels further. Yeah. I need to put them here. One, two... You little lit nipped. Right wheel and left wheel. My bad. Uh, seriously, welcome. How are you doing, man? Good to see you. Now, I think this rover might be a little less. Four wheels. I wonder if I should just put my second wheels as well and leave these rotating. Would that be okay or should I just leave my front wheels um, steering? Emil, welcome!
Mr. Wiki, welcome as well. Good to see you. Thank you for joining. Maleficente, did you already come across a projector in the scrapyard engineering, even in space? Because I have not come across any, both in space, neither in land. I'm assuming if you have a projector, you can kind of circumvent the uh, restriction, I'm assuming. So maybe that's the reason. I'm going to reduce these to like 10% wheels, steering angle. So they only help steering. Uh, break off. <coughs> Excuse me. Break off, and these should be able to break again. Yeah, that that means I can make a little bit more blocks here as well. He mentioned no projector for that reason you said um the thing is just i am i mean i'm using this building restriction for uh split seas uh not for split for the um proxy bar beyond playthrough uh at a certain point we will change to grind to learn which is going to remove we're going to remove split splits uh, build restriction and grind to move uh, grind to learn but I'm assuming there will be no projector, so I will have to give me a projector at a certain point. Because I want to be able to build missiles and drones. And I don't want to be welding them all up one by one. I guess I uh, actually didn't do this properly here. So, this is the line. Alright, that's correct. I need to put another row here. I think that's the reason why I've always was like, why do I... One, two, three. One, two, three. What? What? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Uh, I think I didn't put my wheels properly. I need to put these wheels out.
becoming a long rover it is it is it's kind of annoying to do but you would could edit the restrictions and put the projector in and place a few around for the series or i could just disable the restrictions um let me see could i disable the restrictions no because then i would probably also enable everything i don't i have to look into that maleficent i might have to make a backup and see what happens i can also just do creative and drop a projector as a blueprint and then just copy and paste it the only thing i want to do is at a certain point i want to learn it so i just need to have one that i can grind down But I will have to do a backup and see what actually happens when I switch between restriction and grind to learn. This was... I am very confused. There's only one wheel wrong. Well, no, there's now the whole row is long wrong. This is wrong. This is wrong. This is wrong. Okay. Inventory full. Remember, yeah. You have to go outside. You guys are right. You are too deep, and then all the rest went too deep. Wrong, 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 wrong. Wrong, 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 wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong. <laughs> Alright. What did we do with these wheels? I just disabled... Damn it, I need to take the power and stuff. Fucking hell. Okay, what I'm gonna do... I'm gonna have to put a piston here, lift you up, so I can build you higher. Okay. It is what it is. So, let me just 100% check. This is disconnected, but I'm going to turn you off so you stop pulling. And reverse. There we go. Energy low. Okay, now I don't have any cockpit to charge on. I do have a I have survival kit. And here I was thinking I would be done quickly. The one wheel is an extended wheel? I don't think so. I think all of them are um, short wheels. No?
short off-road wheel. No, that's the same. All right, what I'm going to do, because I want to keep the values to understand which is which. So I'm just going to grind away the, the wheel. And then I'm going to detach the suspension so I can copy the settings. I'm not copy, I just need to understand the settings. Otherwise, I will forget them. So I'm going to detach... Then I can copy over the information on that. Wait, what? <laughs> Where's my information? <laughs> All right, we're going to have to copy the wheel over from the other side. So, uh, right. With drop down. And right. So now these are lined up. Yes. That's all sorted. We just will have to put some more blocks later, but that's all uh, for later. And then we need to put two blocks on here. Did I? Okay. All right. So now the wheels are lined up and hopefully center. My, my, um, this one didn't want to work. My, um, uh, grinder. All right. Thanks for nothing. All right, so... 
Now we got three blocks left, three blocks right, and the wheel is embedded in there. The wheel is embedded here, and now we just need a little bit of an angle here. That starts on this block. So I'm just gonna grind you so I know which one it is. So now, I need to copy over this. There is a way to copy, isn't there? But I always forget how. I'm gonna call this uh, left front, so this is gonna be right front. Wait. This is left front now. Um... Left front two. Right front too. <coughs> Scroll up instead of down and copy all settings. What? Is this copy settings all? And then we say copy all, but name. Then I go here, and then I say copy settings and paste, paste, okay. Thank you, appreciate it. So this is going to be left front, one, Um, this we need to rename to right front. I don't know if I did front one or front. Yes. Then we copy this one. Copy all but name. Copy paste yeah I, that was that was the one I was I forgot shadow I was like which one do I need to do again to copy and but the other one is much easier I mean if you just want to copy all of them What do you mean, me? Hey, Scotius, welcome. Now we just need to put the uh, the unique one there in the corner and there we go. Na, na, na.
Uh, hey, Frodo, welcome as well. I don't know if I missed you coming in. Alright, now we need... I think we Energy need... Low. Let me think. Martin, I said hello to you. I said hello to you. Alright, so we need... Uh, somebody subscribed, but my camera is in the way, damn it. <laughs> uh, Ian, thank you so much for the sub and welcome to the Beeble Hive. I think I'm going to have to make a separate... Um, I'm going to have to make a separate... Setup for uh, Space Engineers. The lines are pointing down. Then eight. That. And then two hinges on here and a Mac plate on you Thank you. 
right. I think we're good. Moving the cap up a bit and putting the survival kit behind it, they can run. Then you can run two rows of mass on the right side. I don't want to, Maleficent, because I want to keep all my conveyors large connected. Because if I use the small conveyors, then half of them don't get withdrawn if I put the wrong stuff in it. So the plan is to have one more large container in here if I find it, and that should be maximum. I don't want to get more containers on it. Uh, Corbin, welcome. Uh, and the plan is to have a second battery here. But to be honest, at the, the progress we're doing right now, we might not ever need it anymore. And get my flyer going soon. I'm wondering... No, never mind. But then I'm just losing... Then I'm losing the space with a conveyor, which is a waste. The large conveyors. I mean, this is one, two, three containers and a large container in the future, hopefully. That's, that's enough. Um, what did I want to do? I wanted to do something else and I forgot what. Um, small cargo contains. There we go. This can go in here. You can go in here. Uh, bulletproof glass. We can leave. Then this can go in there as well. This I'm gonna keep, so I can always repair something if I want to. Um, there was something else. Computers. Antenna. Med base. Power cells. I think we should be okay with this now. Ah, steel plates. That's what I want to drop in here. That's enough. So the rest can go in the cargoes. Okay. Breaking works. Reverse. I still have something clanging. I don't know what it is. this though there's something making a weird noise
All right, never mind. Let's go. Um, are we going east? Yes, let's not drive to that empty hangar again. Let me just double check. Starting position. Starting position is all this, so let's go east. There's actually a small assembler to be found, although what it makes is basically steel and interior plates and motors. It doesn't make bad does it make batteries? I think batteries are the biggest thing. Batteries and of course metal grids, but I plan to take better care of it trust. Uh, I hope so. I made a bigger rover, so we should have a little bit more space to drop stuff on. Trust reviews. Restricted the power cells on that fucking hell. I don't know if I like splits still. <laughs> I need to keep an eye on the road because these th these pings are really quick. We are You know what? Uh GPS, let's turn our starting position and empty hangar. I just want one beacon. in a bit uh, midnight Hitting the ice. Alright, that's okay. I can live with ice. And the storm is over, even better. Alright, we're almost at six kilometers from home, so hopefully we get something new popping in soon. Or at least it didn't increase the speed on your wheels. I, I'm, I'm not unsure. I'm not sure if you're talking about me. Okay, we're gonna have to go around the mountain. Jan, oh, look at that. Welcome, Jan, to the channel, and uh, thank you for the sub. Appreciate that. Four kilometers. Come on, give me something good. Give me, give me, give me something good.
<gasps> is that what I think it is? That looks like a nice large building. That might be a city, I think. It might be a collection of buildings, just like these. Looks promising. I subbed off stream, been enjoying. Thank you, appreciate that, Mr. Wiki. Looks promising, but it might be less promising than we uh, thought. Yeah. We might find some metal goods in there. Even a cargo container. Definitely gonna find motors in there as well. There's definitely computers in there. And maybe another car container in here? Some more pipes and rotors. It's gonna be a power cell in this one. There might be some large, tu large steel tubes up there. All right, so um, there's no guns, so we can drive close and inside. I don't see cargo containers, though. But there might be um, metal grids in here. Start with you. Uh, conveyors. Hey, Jimothy, welcome. And uh, Mr. Ricky, thanks so much for becoming a member. Appreciate that. Uh, Jimothy, welcome, welcome. All right, so we took the battery from this. The only thing that we have stuck there is the uh, large steel tubes. Just double check here. Apart from not being in space and not being an engineer, I'm a lot like this game. What? <laughs> Alright, so we cleared... No. We cleared the container there. Okay, so what's in here? Oh, that's a container. There's no metal grids in it.
No. Did I lose a drill or something? Oh, no, I'm confusing it with another game. Another save. Inventory. Nah, 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 nah. Did I get any metal grits from that? No. This is going to be a fun one to get out, because it's in the ground. Silly autocorrect, that should have said. Thanks for the stream bips, and I hope everyone is well. That doesn't sound the same. I think this autocorrect is probably an AI now. This is still going to be a fixed grid. So what I need is a um, Info converter ship. Thank you. All right, so we did that, we did that. Nothing. Um, I should probably drive my rover closer. Uh, no motors here. 
no motors here. Ow. Oh, there's some there. Inventory full. Inventory full. Need to get my steps in. Okay, no more steel tubes in this. Okay. I need a few of you. There we go. Because I want to check what's up there. Meep meep. <laughs> How did I jump up the first time and now I don't? And now I'm not able anymore. What's this? Hmm? of I just have felt myself in ages. I'm assuming these are always empty. Let's check. There was nothing in here. We can grind you off. 
or to be honest this weapon rack we can't leave it even there's nothing in here that i really want to keep that one might be interesting there as there might be computers up there um what do you have nothing um Energy low. Here, building we're not building anything we're grinding this is not the best find though but okay Hey Maurice, welcome. Okay, so not much now. Got some motors, we got some Got some motors Got some computers But that's about it. Some uh, steel tubes. Alright, let's go to... I think it was east, now we were still going... Oh, what's this? That was my container, I think.
So I guess I landed at the South Pole then, or the North Pole. I'm not entirely sure. Two kilometers behind the mountains there. Because I'm, I'm right on top of the ice. I think that's a wind turbine I'm seeing there. We still got a whole bunch of home, so I think we're just gonna grind this one down. Hydrogen thruster? Come on. Mm. <sighs> You're not giving me anything important. Except you. You are a conveyor, yes. Alright, so, um... Come on. I can't talk- I can't tell you if it's neck-neck. It's- it's what? Neck-neck? This has eight comp uh, eight motors. Yeah. I'm gonna leave it here. You never know. Uh, if your GPS is negative, negative. Um, actually, we've been constantly doing negative. We've been ample. GPS. Let's see. Um, home is like two way. We are two. It's all positive. There's no negative. Um, clean the cat hair. <laughs> oh, cats. Uh, Danielle. Uh, this is a scenario, yes. It's called Scrapyard Engineers from by Splitsy. Um, you can actually f find the link to the, the scenario in the description. I didn't drop my 
uh, collection though. I should have done that as well. I do. I made a collection of all the mods I am using. A little bit different than what Splitz is doing because I, I have a different hut and stuff. I did feel that it was a bit, little bit warmer here, uh, Maleficent. For the moment, the scrap has been meh. Did we ever find a crane on this playthrough? I did. I don't think we found a crane in this playthrough yet. I mean, I made such a large trailer now. Oh. Three kilometers north. Whee. I'm just turning on the AC now and then and burst just to cool the room down a little bit. Because it's starting to uh, warm up in Malton. I think we see it there. It's not a crane. Looks like uh, one of these, uh, what you call them? These buildings on legs. The one that we found our first home in. Though there's no wind turbine on top. At least not yet. Ah, it's smaller. Hmm, are you an oxygen? Yeah, probably. Oxygen or cryo, ch cryo chambers. Another container. Ah! And a battery. We already have this one several times now.
need some batteries in the front. I don't want to keep these anyway. Uh, Jimmy T, see you later, man. I appreciate you jumping in. I hope you have a good, a good one. Clank Cola. <gasps> I forgot about these. Heavy armor. Metal grits. Metal grits. And more metal grits. And no guns. Okay. Guys, we got... I think we can make our... Um... Yep. We can make our... Um, thruster. So, we have enough to make a... That's two. That's eight. We have enough to make our thrusters. Let me just have a quick look-see. Just to see if there's any... Other heavy armor, but there shouldn't be. Mm. I don't want these batteries, and I also don't want the them to trigger anything. Yeah. Mm. I had a, I have enough of these. I have enough of these small batteries, so seriously. That's a good one. Only one power cell missing. <gasps> this is so weird sometimes how these things throw you out. There should not be any heavy metal anymore in this. Come on. Anyway, I don't think there's any heavy armor in these. It seems to only be in these trucks, uh, Stephen, that you can find these.
that's it now. Heavy metal rocks. <laughs> Let's keep driving north, and in the meantime, we can drive back home. I mean, we can take a big circle home. Hopefully, we get something else popping up. So, we have enough metal grids to fix our thruster. That means we have five thrusters in total to build our ship. It would have been great if we have six thrusters, but yeah, I was a little bit clumsy last week. Right? Um, scroll mouse up and it should increase distance. Yeah, yeah, I know about the distance. I'm just pulling it out. Just not, not patient enough, I think. Sometimes I don't know if that's a building or a bush. Looks like a bush. It's a bush. It should also ping if it's uh, a, a grid. As in, it should show a little circle. Is that daylight again? hope if it is we could go a little bit more to the east for a while no, 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 no. No, 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 no. This is the perfect song if uh, Splitzy ever fixes his train and uses to drive around. <laughs> toot toot. Hey Ramesh, welcome. Welcome Matthew and thank you for the sub. I think we're almost driving parallel from our home now. Gonna lurk for a bit? No worries, Ramesh. No worries. <sighs> I, I keep saying Ramesh because you said you like it, but I know it's normal. It's Ramey, Remy. I think it's Remy normally, you know? You said you like Ramesh. <laughs>
Your rover needs more rocket engines? No, it doesn't. Pretty happy with the fact that it doesn't crashes. Is this because I'm driving around the salt pole that my compass is constantly rotating? That's why I'm driving in circle here. You see my compass changing? And I'm not changing uh, my wheels. I was like, why am I constantly adjusting and now my home is straight in front of me? Let's go to southeast for a while. We should just follow the sun. That was the direction we were driving. Yeah, we're in the South Pole. Um, it's much more relaxed built here. I don't know why, it, why they were so panicky. I don't see the problem. Bond and 50 drones. <laughs> mm. It's very quiet, that's for sure. Nothing spawning in for the moment. Could be I might have to do some trash removal. Um, I don't know if that would influence it. Will depending on how many spawns are within a radius. I just don't know because I've been driving a little bit further and further from the home place, hoping to get some things to spawn in, but can I? So we are driving away from known positions, no? Okay. Let's keep on going south then. Let's see if we can hit like 20 kilometers and see if anything starts spawning in there. A 
lot of mountains here. I, mean, I don't like mountains. If he keeps go if he keeps going south, he will head north, then he will be wrong way down. What? <laughs> Three kilometers, three or four kilometers. Somewhere that direction. North. Everything is wrong way up or wrong way down. Hey Delta, good to see you man, how are you? Buongiorno. I think it might be up there though, but we'll see. Let's go around and then we can always turn back. Ooh, that was a bit of a jump. And do those jump is what cost you? Yeah, but I'm okay now. No, I don't have a thruster. Uh, try not to cough in your direction. I don't know, man. I don't know what's worse. Coughing in my direction or, or the other one? What's that? That was suddenly a weird change of... Ah, is that a bridge? Ooh. There might be some grits on there as well. I don't think there's going to be a thruster on it, but there might be some grits on it. It's a train! Choo choo! It's a couple of trains! Ooh! Ooh! There's definitely a warfare battery in this. Now, I'm wondering what's in those chariots. Take them home? Pfft. So much work to take it home. Can I? Eh. No. If I grind this, you should fall over to that side because the weight is more on that. No? Uh, 
Oh, too late. <laughs> Uh, Nox, welcome, and good to hear that, man. I appreciate that. Glad to hear that uh, triggered uh, your interest into the game. And, yep, I agree. It has been definitely a great adventure uh, jumping into that. Alright, so... That's disappointing. going quicker and quicker now and it stops why does it stop uh, hello wait did you no okay. because of that stupid railing Do we take the train with us? It's just, is this just not a waste of energy? What I'm wondering is, 
Is there any heavy armor in these? <laughs> I doubt it. Doesn't look like it. Now I want to make a whole railway like that and put some thrusters on our carts. <laughs> and there's nothing in the there's nothing in the um, carts. All aboard! Anton, see you later. Thank you for jumping in, man. Appreciate you. I'm gonna give this a gentle nudge. I guess the train is a little bit heavy.
Yeah, I know about the um, I know about the script. This is going to cause me some issues with the wheels now, so I should probably extend my piston. Can't you do this from the cockpit? No, because from the cockpit I need to constantly switch between my... and I don't see anything. It's easier using the um, build vision to do this. Hey, low down, welcome. gonna fall next to it now. Yeah, you are. I'm just trying to see if I could just drop it on my rover. Just Mac played it here, didn't you? Okay. I'm not gonna Mac play to anything, no? Okay, did you Mac plate? But I got a bad feeling about this. Because it does seem to be fighting my truck.
Save your game. It might be too late. But what we could do... Could we just try to pull it flat and put a Mac... No, we don't, because I want to keep it away from the wheels. Got a little bit of the shake. Might be one way to get into space, Maleficent. Now, there is a Mac plate there, but I'm not entirely sure if it's Mac plate or not. First things first, we're going to take this Mac plate from you. So you don't Mac plate again. There is no Mac plate here. There's Mac plate there. Okay, it's Mac plate on that one there. Um, that one there. Now, I'm going to turn you off, so that now we can try to lift you a little bit. No? There might be another, another Mac plate pulling it. my Mac plates. Let's not forget this. So there is, is there, I turned you off, I think. You're off your Mac plate to that battery. Anything else? There's no Mac plates here. There's no Mac plates here. So this should normally move. 
because all right let's join this Now they should be not clanging with anything. Yeah, there we go. I guess we're going home quicker than expected. My searchlight is very focused on that wheel. them off when you made the rover bigger did i grind them off the floor i think i might have grind them off when i was doing the uh the battery and the because i don't remember grinding mac plates today before might just be an automatic you know automatic well we got a train with us not sure what we're gonna do with that train Hmm, should we make a Back to the Future train where we fly with the train off into space? Let's go and stop there. There's a building there, probably with a nice battery. Oh! Oh, for the that was just a finger. That went too quickly down. Put your thrusters on it, but it's atmospheric thrusters. I cannot get to space with it. Wait till the train saved you there. Uh, actually, my rover is actually holding itself really well. And let me just knock some wood because 
I don't want to jinx it, but... I think we've been doing really well with this rover. Um, we might have to go a little bit to the left so we don't get the gun on our face. Depending a bit on what turret it is. 800 meters. Let's take the site. And it's gone what? What? Okay. They should be good. There's a battery, no gun. Well, I mean, I think no gun. Wait, is that another building there? No. Let me just double check. We got the rover there. It wouldn't surprise me if there's heavy armor on that one as well. I don't see a gun. Buggers. <laughs> Ooh, you sneak. Ah, what? Why are you shooting me? Can you go under? We could go under. I was like, I'm safe behind this plate. Well, guess not. Large steel tubes in here. We got a battery. Uh, we got a programmable block. Large. And a heat vent large. Um, could we build heat vents? I think so, no? Alright, we can build the heat vents. So, this we could grind down. This we cannot build. This could serve for our... Uh, easy. I don't know if it's glitched. Normally it shouldn't shoot through it. It should actually... Maybe it was just because I was too close.
There's no wheels in this. The steel tube in you. Okay. So this should be dead now. I don't care for the small batteries anymore. The large batteries, however, yeah. As a player, you can shoot through blocks, especially the flat ones. Really? Every time I'm doing that, I'm destroying my block. Yeah, well... Let's fix that turret. It should be mine. Let me just double check. Before we weld it up... Can I turn it off? It's weird that the steel tubes are still showing. Oh no, I was actually aiming at the wrong block. There we go. I'm surprised there's no solar panels. They've been doing a lot of fine tuning, uh, Stephen. Things have been disappearing for sure. That I knew that were before, that they were there before. Okay. Let's hack this one. I have never succeeded in hacking one of these. Never.
Ah, so, um... You know what I lost? <laughs> My gyro. <laughs> Uh, I see. Is there any gyro here to just? I don't think so. No. <laughs> uh, as long you take the computers out, you can hack it. So if you can hack, uh, you can grind it away. Just the computers, you can hack it. The power cells are not part of the. Um, the hacking um Take a basic grinder. I think we had one with us, or did I lose? Left them hope. <coughs> Excuse me. We might have left them home. Yeah. I could have died. If I die, I can get a uh, new grinder. Sorted. I need to pick my um, my wheels of my mouse a little bit more resistant because I'm having too too much. Um, yeah, that's gonna be better. Need a little bit more steps. I should have enough space, no? Yeah.
Are we full? No, we're not. Is this a better gun? Um, machine gun? I don't know. Doesn't seem to have any visor as in any way. Um, Need one mag plate. Is there a reason why you're not? I don't know. Why is this? Come on. My god, that was a challenge. Mm, where am I gonna put that programmable block? Here? Alright. Now it's time to go home. There. <laughs> Perfect. Uh, Zarder, welcome. How are you doing, man? Good to see you. Been watching the scrapyard vods and loving your content. Appreciate that. Needs a rotor on top. Of the rover, you mean, um, you mean here where my uh, searchlight is? Um, could we get some clear weather, please? I would highly appreciate that. Um, your I'm doing good. I'm doing good. With the grabby hands mode, are you using the default settings or the altered ones? 
I am using the one that I just downloaded, which is the uh, experimental... What's it again? I forgot the name now. I went for the power block on the trip home. Let's drive slowly this time. Got too much good stuff with us. And I don't see any other lands behind that little ridge there, so this could go down quickly. Wait, did we go there? I mean, I... It... It all shows white. Let's go there. If there's anything interesting, we can mark it. And then drive home. Never too much capac until you get capacked. <laughs> Looks white. That means that it's not going to be dangerous anymore. I already took that over. Is that the helicopter that we uh, cleaned out? Looks like it. Yeah, we already cleaned this up. Alright, let's go him. Oh, that's what's happening. You know what? I was wondering that. I was watching Splitsy, um, I don't know when anymore, and he was like, couldn't lift something. I was like, but why? Why is this so heavy for you? Now I understand. This is an altered version, so everything is much heavier, or the, the mod is less powerful. Then I can understand why the crane is so much handier as well, because most of the stuff I can just pick up with my hands. The only thing that's heavy is like batteries, heavy containers, things like that, but... Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think this is where we uh, picked up our large container. Yep. It's really just a, a command and game. Yeah, I'll leave it as this. Oh, no, I can I can totally understand that, uh, Wiki. I, I am pretty much the same. But I am not advanced enough uh, in this game to really, like, say, like, okay, I'm going to go totally crazy. For example, I am really, really interested in using the Reavers bot in my playthrough of the Proxima Beyond, but I will not do it for my first season. My plan is... 
my plan is for my Proxima Beyond playthrough is to manage to get away from the system I'm at. So the goal is to build a jump drive or whatever, which is kind of the end goal or something, or a several jump drive, which allows me to jump away from the system. Now, what's going to happen, my plan, my idea is actually to land into a Reaver territory. That would be episode season two. Which is then a little bit more dangerous, but at that time I should also be more advanced. I shouldn't be able, I shouldn't be stuck with build restrictions and things like that anymore. Because you don't, you cannot do a river fight with what you have. Having the scrapyard and then getting everything shut up, it's. Was that even without Reavers? Even without Reavers? Uh, need to be able to free, pl freely place blocks. Have you played with scripts much in SE? Park has a great script. Yeah, um, yeah, I saw Splitzy doing it as well, and I'm definitely interested in using it. Um, but it's not like a priority at all. I just want to make Mac play too. on the stack. Honestly, I think we have enough to get something going. We just... I think we need to stop collecting stuff now and just grind things down. Seven, six. What just happened? There's a Mac plate below here as well. Now, how many black Mac plates is you connect to? Two? Yes, you did, you little one. Alright, uh, auto lock off, switch lock. Now we just need to disconnect the other one. Ah! Yo, Fred, good to see you, man. How are you? Welcome. Uh, loving the ship you put it together. Uh, you're going to like what I'm doing right now. I'm ex I was recording this morning for it. Uh, now we just need to put an 
to get their edits, see how far I get, because I already have five hours of editing, uh, recording, six hours of recording. So now I need to edit this all down to an hour. And then see, do I get an hour? If not, I can do some more recording, but I don't want to overdo it. Yes, yeah, Zardar, I did, but I've been adding so many Mac plates in the meantime that now the group is completely messed up, so I need to do it again. Uh, let me just drive back and forth so we can put that battery in the right spot. Push it from the bottom here. Because I don't think Splitsy can do this. Pull the pull the battery inside like I'm doing right now. Um which is understandable because this thing should be really heavy. But I've been I've been pushing a lot of heavy stuff in my life when I was uh, moving stuff. This it's all about momentum and all about leverage. Yeah. So we can place that battery afterwards. All right, let's uh, put that train. Can barely lift a small grid gyro. Ooh. Alright, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put another piston on... Um... No? <laughs> we got another piston on this. Come on, that one. Juicy Zero, welcome to the stream, good to see you. Okay, so... Piston... Can you stop shaking? I'm trying to... Um... Let's 
Let's put the mag plate on already because I have the materials for it. I do find it... F I need steel plates, that's why, okay. Right, let's clear this and do this again. So, I need one of you. 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 Um... Wee. So, we're gonna have to give you shared inertia attention. We're gonna have to give you shared inertia attention. I just need to check something. This is no velocity. This is no velocity. This is no velocity. Here. Just to stop shaking a little bit more. And then we're gonna rotate you so you're a little bit straight. Then we're gonna extend you. Grab it. That's not good enough. Actually, I think we should do you. Yeah, it's gonna be hard. No, no. Yeah, I thought so. I was like, you're not gonna want. You're not gonna want to do that. I'm just going to put you on the ground and then give you a little bit of a push. There we go. And you should be now happy to lift it again. There we go. Um... You know what I should have put out there? Another hinge. Because... Oh, yeah, we need another hinge because even if I stretch this out, I won't be able to get high enough to flip this underneath here. So there should have been another hinge on this rotor. my toe
I don't need any more. Juicy. I lost my toast. Can you... I want to grab you from the bottom. Uh, not from the bottom, from the top. Down again. Right, so now I should be able to grab you on the top. If I drive forward. I guess that hinge cannot lift it, but that's okay. It has to be there anyway. Um... Come on, come down. Um, 
What do you mean access denied? I guess we need to hack this whole thing here first. Okay. Um. <laughs> as far as I know, there is a uh, a battery in there. Well, this is terrible. These doors need to don't need to be hacked. So what is still needs to be hacked is the battery, I think. I think there's a helm in there. Yeah. Okay, let me just build some blocks. Battery is not there. We have a helm, that's all. I might have to weld the helm up. I already forgot what they needed computers. I think like five more. Ten of these. Engines may be inside. Oh, yes, true. Yeah, there's two hydrogen engines in there, no? Okay, it's much more than I expected. Let's see. Heat vents. I'm assuming these might also have, or is this just access denied? Doesn't say access denied, does it? No, it doesn't. Okay. Hydrogen tanks. There's a lot of stuff here. There's a lot of stuff here that I need to hack. Okay, we're not gonna keep that helm, so let's get the helm off. I'm gonna clean out the inside already. This battery, is this... As the computers are already out, I don't need to hack it, but I don't know. There's gonna be hydrogen engines in here, and of course the heat fans in the front. I didn't... Did we... Yeah, okay, we can. We have to remember how these heat vents are. Um... But these heat vents don't have computers in them, so I shouldn't be bothered about them. It's the engines. 
There's nothing in that. There's nothing in that. So the only thing I can think of is the hydrogen tanks. Yeah, maybe that's a good idea if I just... But I I cannot hack this, no. Doesn't matter. If I hack this, it's always going to stay unfriendly. Until I hack the... The grid itself. How many batteries are in here? I think there might be more than one battery in here as well. O2 generator. So, that's the battery. There's nothing in there. So where are the tanks? I almost feel like they are somewhere here. How many were there again? Six? The other down there. Alright guys, it's ours. Yeah. Alright. What do you mean wheel could not be placed?
energy low. Well, it was a very intensive job, so yeah, I can understand that. Alright. <clears throat> so that means this battery is mine. No? It says access denied though. I'm not gonna grind you up, uh, wild you up yet. This is gonna be another project. Alright, we got the train. We got some IDs. Alright, let's think about our, um, because now we should have enough to weld this one up. Yeah, yeah. And... Bing. Let's hope you have enough motors. Okay. I still got two metal grids left. Did we find more than we needed? Not bad. We're missing motors, but I can grind down some of the doors and stuff as well, I think. Motors, motors, motors. Never enough motors. I think, could I put you in between there or else there's going to be a tight squeeze? Doesn't seem like there's a lot of collision for this noise. 
we can live with that. Did I not have like a whole bunch of merge blocks there on the... What? There's no connection on this at all. <laughs> it's not that I don't believe you. I just want to be 100% sure. <laughs> well, well, back to this. Why do you say that you withdraw everything and then you don't? Hmm? You piece of... I got one, two, three, four containers. One is not finished. We do not need. We don't have any here. We need a lot of. We need a lot of this to fix that container. So that's gonna be. So I might wait with easy for the moment until we get some more uh, um, containers. Uh, is it a steep learning curve? Juicy Jiro Space Engineers is is challenging. There is definitely a, a learning curve that you have to get past before you really feel like you can have the fun. But what I'm playing right now is a scenario extremely focused on challenge. That means that a lot of what I'm doing, you won't come across in vanilla. Like, you know, I need to survive on things I found in the wild. While in the vanilla space in years, you will be able to just build it all. Hey, uh, Matt, welcome. If I didn't say hello to you already. Don't know. Um, how many motors are there in? Four in you. Four in you. There might be some motors in here as well. We yeah, I want to keep that engine, I think. I don't think we want to keep this truck. Uh, 
Wow, 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 wow. Can I play Scenario in the Xbox Game Pass version? Um, I don't think so. I think there are scripts involved now in this. Oh yeah, you could do it on a dedicated server, Nano, uh, Nado Nerd. Uh, if you play it on a dedicated server and somebody have installed it for you, you will be able to play this without having to have the scripts on your Xbox. True. Got some tools in here which I want to keep. There's no motors anyway. Uh, motors? Yep. Don't look, Bob. Don't look. I'm taking the motors. I still got stuff in here as well. Don't tell me I got metal grids in here, no. No. But I guess we should just take it all out. I'm hoping one day there is a option for Xbox and PlayStation to have their uh, scripts, but it all depends a bit on the... on PlayStation and Sony. Uh, Sony and Microsoft. You know, there's, there's actually no motors in here anyway. I think uh, Sony and Microsoft are very, very careful and afraid of um, hacking. I need motors, so everything that has motors is going. Motors, 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 motors. Alright, no motors here. Uh, you might have motors as well in the wheels now. In this storage, it showed two motors in a cab somewhere. No, it's the cab of my of my uh, truck. I need to get it out of there. I'm trying to get this truck to lift, but um... yeah. no. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna do it like this. You will not deny my motors. We still got motors in the doors. Motors in the doors. Motors in the doors. Motors, motors, motors in the doors. Uh, I got 22 and 3. That's 25 motors. That's all I have for the moment. Let's see if I can get another cluster working. I don't know. I thought I was, I thought I was a little bit more progressed, but guess not. That's another eight. Hinges on the train. There might be a hinge on the train still.
I, if I recall correctly, there is none of these racks that have motors in these. Energy low. This has two motors. Eighty-eight. I'm still. <laughs> it's like what? Forty-seven. Forty-nine motors short. Oh my god! Forty-nine motors. Eight. I could steal them from the turbines for a moment. Yep, I guess we're gonna have to go on a drive. Doesn't matter how much I get from them, I'm never gonna be able to get the motors going. Alright. All deposits. I think this is gonna be a grind fest now. Focus is on getting stuff, not, I mean, getting materials, not blocks. The only blocks we take with us are engines, assemblers, refineries. Uh, you know what I should do as well, probably, but might be due next week. The problem is that the oxygen generator is in there. If we could link up the train... With the system, we could actually start making hydrogen and oxygen. Uh, small cargo containers. And let's see what we can sl slot in here. Nothing. We're getting pretty full again. Um, I'm gonna leave most of this in here. There we go. Medium car container. Much stuff. Okay, we do have a connector. Eight thousand liters. Let's shove it in there. There we go. So we're nice and empty with a little bit. I don't have motors anyway. I think. Let me just double check. No. Brum, brum, brum. Get rid of the scrap metal. Are we going back to the south or the north? Yeah, the battles. I didn't think about the battles, uh, Malith. The, the crates are good because... Although, I think the crates have been limited in, the, um, in these playthroughs. Because as far as I remember, the large crate has like 3,000. But if you build them yourself, they are smaller. I have to check in that again. You can check that next time. Yes, I'm using the battery to drive. I'm currently... I have three hours left at the speed I'm going. If I don't give gas, I've got 19 hours. Gas. If I don't give electric... I don't know what you call it. If I don't give power... So, the sun is going down, of course. We 
We're gonna have to do some speed though. We need like two kilo 20 kilometers before things are gonna start spawning in. We already cleaned that out. We should check. If there's doors on that, we should grind these doors down. Wee wee! Um... No, 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 no. I do like this song, actually. <laughs> no, 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 no. Yeah, those are gone. Right. See, these ones has 3,000, but if I want to build them myself, they seem to be... Jaffa, thank you much. Thanks so much for the subscription and welcome to the Beeble Hive. No, no, no. Need to up your speed on that baby to 60 meters per second. I don't know. I already grind everything off, you know. Mm -hmm. Let's go. 60 meters per second. Have you seen how this thing is going to fly if I go 60 meters per second? That's how I don't get my rover crashed. I'm just here, Matt. I'm not streaming on Twitch. I have been considering it several times, but there is too much issues with uh, cross-streaming. Oh, 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 oh. Well, hello. Six kilometers. That means at 9.4 kilometers from home. It doesn't have theater mode. It should have. You should be able to press the button that opens up the, the screen or completely and the chat goes below it. I mean, I'm doing 44 now per second. Is that, is that not good? This is not... Are you not entertained? <laughs> Are you watching on the television, Matt, maybe? Is that what you mean? Yeah, I, as far as I know, remember, remember YouTube has a theater mode. So if you go in the, uh, I need to think now. Bottom right corner, there should be a button on the screen that switches to different um, sizes of screen: theater, mini player, full screen. Um, Dirk, thank you so much. Or Dirk, depends on the language you come, uh, what you speak. Uh, welcome and thank you for the sub. Appreciate that. Okay, there should be something here. It's not much. But it's a beginning. Beep. 
got some wheels, a missing wing, no engines on the wings, no thrusters. <gasps> Hello, is it me you're looking for? You should see the difference between heavy armor and light armor because of the framing. And I doubt there's any in here. got the conveyor at least two one conveyor already there might be another one in the back there although that's the engine i'm not gonna key this engine so let's just grind the wing um, as far as i know heat vents cool down your um is that a tank that's a tank There's no motors in it. Motors. As I said, we are not gonna take it with us. Gone. I don't care. I'm not I'm not collecting anymore. That's it, no. I think we got most of it. I don't see heavy armor. Uh, bad pain day? No worries, Fred. Have a good one, man. I appreciate you. Um, so, Matt, as far as I know, the, the heat vents cool down your... Um, whatever you're using, like engines and stuff. But, to be honest, I'm not 100% sure. I think it reduces the the power use of your batteries as well. I mean heat vents uh opens and emit lights no there's actually no there's actually no uh pro um thing on it i might be confusing it with something else then They have changed a lot since I played it last summer. Uh, you mean the... Um, the scenario. I don't have a Mac plate here. 
I don't have a mag plate here. I guess I'm gonna have to do some uh, re. Um, we need some macking. We need some re macking. No, uh, Malef, Malef sent, uh, Steven did this uh, scenario before um, and it has changed a lot since the first release. Even the starter rover is different, uh, Steven. Well, this is great. Uh, I'm new to the game, so enjoying watching streams. Ah. Done a lot of building and balancing. Yeah, he's made, he's definitely made it sure that things don't go too easy. Uh, <laughs> um, he took away the light from the starter rover. He took away the weapon rack of the starter rover. Because there's a few things in there that you can use to fix your gyro too easily. There's a lot of heavy armor blocks that also disappeared from the building parts. And the big crane with goodies, the big crane is the one. I have not found a crane in this one, in this playthrough. I did find one in my testing playthrough. I think that is actually... I had more luck in that one than in this one so far. I mean, we had good luck. But I found like two uh, large containers. I have like 10 hydrogen thrusters. 15 uh, large thrusters, uh, the um, atmospheric thrusters. That was a good run. I'm trying to keep going to that way, but... Give me something good. Give me complete something good. Four kilometers, that means 17 from home. I think it's might be that there. Explosions? None. Not, not one so ever. I did almost get killed though, but it was just more a little bit of a brown pants moment than. Um... Oh yeah, I did kill myself with the. Uh... <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> uh, hey Akini, welcome. I think that's there. You see that there? Yep, that's there. I, I tripped, fell, and broke my neck. That's something that happened as well.
I think we found solar panels, uh, Steven. <laughs> Wee! Would you look at that? I see you. That's uh one. Two large grid solar panels. It doesn't seem to be moving, and I'm wondering if it's because there's no power on this grid. Well, there is power on this grid, otherwise it wouldn't... Hmm. Maybe it doesn't have any ammo. These are oxygen tanks. Ooh. Uh, what did I say again? Not taking anything with me. Hydrogen tank. God damn. <gasps> what, what is this? Uh, guys, it's Christmas. It's Christmas. I need a bigger rover. <laughs> One metal grid. They are in the ground, which I'm not happy with. No, you cannot take those thrusters. You only claim from the motors. Yeah, right. We got solar panels. We got... Oh my God, this is a good, good find. And I don't have enough space, I think. Okay. Um, we're going to fix you so I can take the ammo. Now 
now. I should be able to fix that container. Do I have? No? Yeah, I, that's going to be the plan, I think, um, Matt. That's going to be the plan. Question, how can large steel tubes fit in... Yeah, sometimes large things, smith in, large things fit into small little spaces. I think this is a uh, done. Oh no. Ah. Why would you keep is this because of you? I want to check the bottom of this thing. Don't see any heavy armor. All right. No heavy armor. Time for a trailer. Pfft. I don't know, man. I think my rover is a little bit too low to the ground for a ro for a trailer. Or we need to make a long. I don't know. Brett, the jalopy never had heavy armor. Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? Uh, we're going to grind down all these. Uh... You and Kevin should play. Uh, I take. I take off work to watch. 
doesn't like this kind of play. I don't think so. I don't think he does. This takes too long. I think it takes too long for him, this kind of playthrough. why he doesn't play on the community server at Splitsy. You mean the um, the scrapyard server? Is that what you mean? Listen, buddy. Shut up. Trust is on the left, trust on the right. Mark, by the way, welcome. I don't know if I said hello to you. We got all this stuff. I'm happy there's no battery, that's for sure. Oh, this thing is... It's a shame not to take with you. I'm not gonna take anything of this with me. I think I got so many steel tubes now. Uh, is it because of the solar panels? I think it is, no. Oh. Yeah, I... 
can grab them, but if I grind them loose, they're gonna fall down. No, they are like there's nothing supporting them. No, short it's fine no it's not fine wait uh Drop something under the vehicle. Take a layer of the side of the building. <laughs> Steven, that's actually not a bad idea. <laughs> um. <laughs> uh. I'm seeing a lot of dangerous ideas as well. Hey Doom Robot, welcome. Uh, which one are we grabbing actually? Um, I think we can just... Can we? No, I need to grind it off first. So I need to hack it. Then weld it up. Then 
detach. If you detach, then you need to catch the second one. Why? Um, I think we should manage to get these two solar panels to lay on this platform and then maybe build a little bit of a thing over it so we can snap these two on top of this. Oh, by the way, I didn't merge these together. I just hung them on the merge blocks, uh, on the mag plates. It was easier. It has power. Yeah, you could, but I don't want this building. <laughs> okay, if I now detach you. Then I uh, connect the other one to that one. Yeah. Gra Let's go and grab the second one. Please get a second solar, just in case. Uh, that was the plan. How are you sticking the sol solars down to the truck on each other? Uh, first of all, I'm, I'm going to have to merge them together, which I'm going to need large merge blocks for. So I might have to still take it off, we'll see. Because this is going to take some space to put that second merge block on. I think I might have to lift it. Put the second merge block on. Put the other one on. Put another merge block on. Then take it down. 
then mag plate this onto uh, this on this one um, and then probably I'm gonna have to build some blocks on the sides so I can snap some things on top of it above the yeah Is this the hinge? Uh, I suppose it didn't stick the merge blocks because I won't have enough space to put my merge block. Well, I could have grinded everything away, but yeah. So, and the second one to the met cargo. The what? The met cargo? Yeah, if I want to build a large grid ship, we definitely could use the solar panels to then um, power it. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, I do not believe in solar panels on planets if you have atmosphere. Yeah, the plan is, Mal Malif, is just to, this is something I'm not going to use. This solar panel is pointless for me now, but it's good to have. So once I can get to space and I can get a small grid ship to space, we can focus on making a large grid ship space, a uh, ship in space up and then come back down and come and collect the lot, like the large container, um, the solar panels, things like this. Because I'm going to tell you, large containers is no easy feat in space so far. Alright, so let me just check which direction is this merge block on a snap. Like that. Okay, so you are already good. You're already good. All right. I'm just gonna drop everything in here. I got four, four large steel tubes. I got seven large steel tubes. We should be good. The question is now, where are you gonna snap? 
perfect. It's simply perfect. <laughs> Alright, let's... Um, You're not very happy, are you? Together? I'm just gonna mac merge them together first, so I only need to mac plate one. Um, are you telling me that? I'm missing a large steel tube. We can always grind a wheel down. You love each other. <laughs> there, sort it. Uh, what keyboard shortcut do you use to swap from the item to get materials? Um, I'm using the auto build the plan build planner So if you for example wanna let's say I want to build this up here You see I'm missing one steel plate if I do right mouse button I'm gonna store this into my build planner if you know go to my build planner You will see there's gonna be a little pla panel here the floor. I'm gonna remove you there go. This floor panel here, I just add it. I can then go to my connector, then I press middle mouse button, and I'm going to withdraw what I need to build this piece. If you have inventory, if I have like this in my inventory, I want to get rid of it. I can go to the connector, I can press alt middle mouse button, and then I push everything that I can put in there into the container now i'm gonna put this in there as well 
because not everything gets shifted into the containers when Uh, I know the right mouse middle bus. It's when you're placing a new item like the merch, but they didn't exist. He's talking about talk, taking a block out that you have on your cursor. You mean this? Because I'm using my hotbar in the bottom uh, mat. I have a hotbar with numbers. Ah, uh, no. If I press 8, you can see there's a little plus there. If I go to my piston... You see this piston has a little plus next to it that means it's more than just a piston. There is a piston, the piston head, and the merge block in there. And this is a small merge block. So if I now just, let's say, I take my hinge for example, I can rotate my mouse with my mouse wheel and I can switch between the hinge parts. If I go to my piston, I can rotate with my mouse wheel to switch between the build parts. But it has to have a plus next to the uh, icon. How do you get parts for that part? Well, it's the same. Like I have this Mac plate in my hand. I just aim and I just middle mouse button. And I got the build parts to build it. I'm not entirely sure what I'm missing. So if you have, let's say, for example, I want to build this here. I can just aim and say, I want to build this. It's going to retract, retract everything I need. Um, let me just clear that again. The build planner is funny though. It does seem to be struggling now and then. What are you stuck on? Mine also. The build planner has a bit of a funny moment now and then, or it doesn't retract whatever you or everything. Mac plates. This is now fixed on my rover. Um, what we can do now is just build a bit of a frame around here. Collision doesn't seem to have a problem with that, but okay. I think I should make something like that with hinges. Like a second flatbed so we can put stuff underneath and then we can close it when we uh, put stuff on top.
So you have like a two... L What's this? That's amazing. I don't believe in trailers. <laughs> Just asking for trouble, trailers. Alright. Um, I don't think... If I would grind, you lose. You're stuck in the ground, aren't you? <laughs> uh. Hey, Auntie, welcome. If I would, if I would um, install the, no, I, we cannot know because Atmos, no, it doesn't work. I was just thinking if I would install the aerodynamics mod, I would be able to fly with my solar sails out of the system, but no.
All right, we're gonna have to put uh, a little panel on that. Onion Mura, I think it is. No, Onino Mura, welcome, Onion. <laughs> I said Onion. <laughs> oh my god, this is terrible. Uh, we need the uh, control panel somewhere. Where did we put it? Here we go. No, no, no. Than this one instead. Uh, are these tanks heavy? Holy! Uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. This one is less heavy, it seems. Although, it just... Alright. Um, I don't use the heavy, has, uh, heavy gas uh, mods in this one. Let's say you have a crane. I have a crane. Look, it's a crane. Has served me more than enough. You want to give yourself a hernia? <laughs> you're blocking the one no yeah i think you are the one blocking it It's weird, no? It seems like momentum really does it. <laughs> I just need you up there, buddy. So I can grab the crane it. No, no, it's okay. I don't want it. Leave it.
You're a Mac player to something? You... No! I did not allow this yet. Uh, Stephen, thank you so much for joining. I appreciate you. And uh, thanks for the subscription as well. I'm going to extend this a bit. Gorilla, thank you so much for subscribing as well, and welcome to the Beeble Hive. Ah. Ah. Alright, we got one. Time for number two. Did we just use this one, I think? Yeah. All right. Just move a truck. I don't want to move a truck. Well, I could move a truck. I don't care. I'm now... Doesn't believe in moving trucks. No. Don't believe in moving trucks as well. Oh, that was not the... I believe in manpower. I think it's hooking up a little bit there though i guess we're gonna have to move the van <laughs> take notes egypt that's how pyramids can be done quicker <laughs> It's weird, no, because sometimes you can actually really pull it and then suddenly nothing anymore. I don't know what's going on. It does feel like the hydrogen tank is much heavier than the um, oxygen tank. not moving all right um
Guess we should move the van. The grunting, yeah, I think the grunting does definitely help. I am a firm believer in grunting. We're closer to the curve. We need to uh, Not perfectly centered though. But we could I think we can manage. If I just now drop you down. Yeah, but it's it's gonna be the same, see? If I'm gonna spin it, the weight is gonna be on the other side, so it's not gonna make a difference. Can we go down, please? Thank you. Got enough space to go a little bit further. And we flip it again. And then we retract you a little bit. Uh, 
Ouais, là. We got it, guys. We have everything. The motor still, probably. <laughs> So this old man is off to bed. See you next time, Stephen. Thanks for jumping in. It's actually getting late as well for me. Um, let me see. What do we have? Motors. I got 17 motors. We needed what? 40? Actually, I'm not too heavy. This is only 49k. Uh, we were going west, no? I already forgot where we were going, but I think it was go west. Need to figure out which DLCs. I don't know if it shows on the scenario which DLCs you can use. But if I'm correct, did they use any um, unique blocks or did they went for as vanilla possible blocks? getting bumpy here and I have a hardly any view on where we're going Right behind me, four kilometers. Let's 
South, southeast, southeast. Um, as, but as far as I know, if you find... Let's say I get a blueprint from somebody with a warfare battery and I don't have the warfare DLC. Don't I get the warfare block, but I cannot make it myself? I don't know anymore. I do not see an effing thing. <sighs> hmm. The thing is, Akini. This is not pasting, this is spawning in. The block spawns in with a uh, code. It's not like a blueprint. So I'm wondering if the spawning is different than a blueprint. I'm pretty sure Splitzy had an answer to that, but I'm not entirely sure anymore what the... Um Yeah, I don't see an I don't see a thing, so I cannot judge where the thing is. Can the weather please clear up? Some of the blocks as well, or the night are even by the way, welcome, good to see you. Um, some of the blocks are actually part of vanilla, even if they were released with the Warfare Pack, for example. Uh, for example, the AI blocks should be available for everybody, I think.
the DLCs are not too expensive if you're careful all the night because it's like what three three euros for the DLC. Yeah, I'm kind of lost. I have no idea where that thing spawned in. And the weather is not giving up. For less than 20 is it that much i thought it was much cheaper it is like i would say like seven eight did i i don't know well cleared up i just don't know where the build is i don't believe it's going to be up there anymore now It would be nice if this thing pings a little bit more often. Alright, I'm gonna continue through the mountains there, but... I think we're gonna end off soon though. I could keep, you know, playing this for a while, but um, I'm getting tired, and this is when mistakes are made. I think it's there. And it looks like just pipes. I risked all that for pipes. Your fault, stupid tree. Oh. 
Holy. Um, okay. I would say there, maybe. This is all pretty steep, isn't it? Um, if we go there and then in the valley. Gonna be a little bit bumpy, but that's okay. So yeah, all this for pipes. I mean, there might be some motors in it. Motors. There is something there that might be interesting. Man, pretty banged up, isn't it? Oh, there's containers. Oh, yeah, okay. Let's see what we've got. You're going for bigger wheels? What I'm going for is for uh, flying. <laughs> no more wheels. Well, that's disappointing. He doesn't believe in wheels. Thirty two motors. Um, okay, we can go again.
So yeah, we got some motors, but it's all not much. How many motors do we have now? 40. Well. I guess we have to do a more riding, but uh, that's not going to be for today. I think we're going to call it here. So guys, I'm going to call this off for today. Thank you so much all for joining. I will be uh, getting to bed and hopefully I can do some editing tomorrow on the um, Proxima Beyond playthrough. Um, what I'm going to do, I do want to check if anybody is streaming that we can rate. Most likely nobody that is going to be playing Space Engineers, however. Um... Redirect. Um, I'm gonna rate Action Plans Gaming. YouTube is definitely way less uh, busy in streams, that's for sure. So yeah, we're gonna be rating Action Plans Gaming. He's doing in Shrouded. Uh, he's doing the renovation of Woodcourt. Great builder, by the way. So. Stick around if you want to see some building in Entrouded. And I will see you again next week, Friday, for another stream on Space Engineers. And, of course, Wednesday should be release of the Proxima Beyond Episode 3. And that's going to be it. Have a good one. Appreciate you all being here. And bye-bye for now. <laughs>